Hi everybody. Well, fall is here and cooler weather is on the way. So we're gonna start getting our jackets out and we're gonna need a place to hang them. And we've had these three coat hooks screwed directly to the drywall up here. And I noticed this one has come loose. So I think I can come up with a better solution for this. So let's take these coat hooks down and head out to the shop and see what we can come up with. Wow, apparently I'm the only stud in here. I've got this small piece of red cedar that I've been keeping around the shop for a couple of years now. So I think it'll be perfect for this project. I really like the color swirls throughout the wood and I like this really cool live edge and I'm going to try to incorporate that into the project. Well, I thought this side was going to be my show side with all these color stripes running through the board. But check out this side after cleaning it up with the planer. It's got all these neat little color swirls in it. And it also has the best view of the live edge. So this is definitely going to be my show face. So now I just need to do something with the ends so they don't look so chopped off. Here's the shape I ended up with, and I randomly cut the ends at an angle on the bandsaw so they would kind of blend in with the live edge, and I really like the way that turned out. So I'm going to keep the bottom of it straight, and let's put the coat hooks on it and get an idea of what it's going to look like. And yeah, that's going to look pretty cool. I've already marked the board where I want to pre-drill the holes for mounting the hooks as well as mounting the board to the wall. Now since the wall this is going on doesn't have any studs behind it, I'm pretty much open as to where I drill those mounting holes. So I'm going to use a technique I saw from Dale Weinke over at Beaver Valley Woodworking. And I'm going to drill the mounting holes for putting this onto the wall underneath where the coat hooks are going to go so that they'll hide those mounting screws. <laughs> I guess I'm not the only stud in here. Well, this was a fun little project and I really like how it turned out. It's nice and sturdy and it looks cool. It's a whole lot better than it was. Whenever I want to try out a new technique, I like to do it on something smaller like this. 
now that I've done this live edge wall mounted coat rack, I feel like I could tackle something larger like a coffee table or something with a live edge on it. Don't forget to like this video and please leave a comment. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please subscribe. And let's see how this looks. Oh, well darn, you can't even see the thing. Oh well, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.